A lot of coin for this place. That's right, pal. Tonight I'm paid and blessed. And all I had to do was turn my head. To all my friends. Hey, step back. I know important people. We're going to show this city what to do with heathen oxmen. So, someone paid you to take a Canari delegate? I made a good wage for looking away while someone tamed a hornhead. So what? They said I should watch out for sympathizers. Traitors. You want something? Take it from me and my new friends. Good coin means good friends. Come on! This isn't necessary, you know. What? What do you want? I just did what he said. It was more coin than I've ever seen. That's very good. Now just tell me who and where. Templar. It was a Templar. I didn't get the name. We met near the Chantry. He, he said taking these Kunari was serving the Maker. I swear, he even had the seal of the Grand Cleric. True is true. Great. A Templar. Serving the Grand Cleric, no less. A drunk says the Grand Cleric funded zealots through a rogue Templar. This is enough evidence for you. It's a careful chat about missing Konari. Hey. It's not like the Templars are going to like me, no matter what I do. The Grand Cleric, please. Tell her... Tell her it concerns the Kunari. Sarah Hawk. Sister Patrice. Mother Patrice. Time has changed us both. Grand Cleric Elfina cannot grant an audience to just anyone. What do you want? Funny how you and issues with the Kunari seem to go together. And you always assume their side. I was naive when last we met. I did not want you dead, but I felt a death was necessary. That may be too fine a point for you to understand. But you must admit, you came out the better for it. A Templar may have misjudged an order, and abused the Grand Cleric's authority. I assure you, the Templars would never embarrass the Chantry, at risk of the Knight Commander's wrath. Men were hired for the righteous task of kidnapping a Kunari delegate. A pause that says you knew. But does Her Grace? The Grand Cleric trusts her stewards to enact the wishes of the Maker. I'll speak to Her Grace another time. You will not always be here. Stubborn. All right, Sarah Hawk. If you won't abandon this, let me offer you something. The Templar you seek is a radical who has grown... unreliable. Confronting him may do us all a favor. And he is what to you? He is my former bodyguard, Ser Von El. Assume what you wish, but I offer him to you as reconciliation. Meet me at this location. I invite you, Sarah Hawk. Come see the unrest these Kunari have inspired. Is there something she's not telling us? It's her game for the moment. I see Torilin's back again. Like any beast, remove the fangs and it is lost. They are weak before the faithful of the Maker. The only certainty in their precious Kuhn is death before the righteous.
Sevonel. Take a knee, faithful. The Chantry blesses us. You claim a blessing when you have used the authority of the Grand Cleric so openly? You have brought wrath down upon you. You remember Sarah Hawk? The Kunari have friends, Templar. How will you answer their allegations? You want a fight? Face someone whose weapons are not bound. Templars are cowards. They only pick on those whose lives they already hold in their hands. Righteous! Destroy them! to bring this mess to the Viscount's attention. Madness! Madness! Yes, Excellency. Chantry involvement. Even if they are fringe elements, oh, it could not be worse. The Chantry has seen the abuses the Templars get away with. Why would they not think to do the same? You killed them? All of them? A mother serving the Grand Cleric allowed this to happen. Are you quite sure? She held a blade with them? Told them to fight you? No, I cannot say that. No, of course not. Blasted mother. You have no idea the storm these allegations would cause. It would destroy what support I do have. had trouble with her before. She is... slippery. I understand. I will make my inquiries. Gently. And you should be careful in your associations. For now, we have other problems. We have the delegate, but... I can't return the bodies to the Canari in this state. Sarah Hawk. You know the Arishok. What should I do? Hiding this would only make it worse. It would, wouldn't it? I'm losing my sense of how to balance this nightmare. I appreciate your help in this matter. As bad as this is, it could have been much worse without you. Kirkwall owes you. I owe you. Enchantment! No, Leandra. Leandra. What's wrong, Uncle? There you are. Where's your mother? Is she feeling all right? I'm sure she's all right. Why are you so upset? Your mother didn't show up for our weekly visit. Is she ill? She is here, isn't she? No, Gamlin. We haven't seen her all day. Where could she be? With her suitor, perhaps? Suitor? Leandra never mentioned a suitor. Well, those lilies arrived for her this morning. 
White lilies. I know something about that. Don't just leave me waiting. What is it? There's a killer in Kirkwall who sends his victims white lilies before he takes them. He's murdered several women already. No. You're wrong. Leandra is fine. It doesn't hurt to be optimistic. Maybe... Maybe Leandra took another path to my house. I could have just missed her. I'm going back to Lowtown. You should help Gamlin look for your mother. You might be able to track her more easily once night falls and the streets empty out. All right. The boy and I will stay here in case she returns. I hope all is well. Nothing new to report, I'm afraid. Should we take this outside and see if it floats? I did. What of it? I told you already. I saw her. Did you see where she went? What do I get for telling you? Here's a few silver. Buy yourself some food. And new shoes. <gasps> That's real silver, that is. I'm your man, through and through. Tell you everything I know. That lady was here. She looked like she was going to take the bridge to Hightown. But then a man came up to her. He stumbled and fell over right at her feet like he was dead. His hands were all bloody, like he'd been in a fight. The lady shook him. And I think he said, help. She got him to his feet, and he was wobbly. Uh, it, it was funny. Anyway, they left, and that's all I saw. What did the man look like? He was a man. He had hair and a nose. And nice clothes. But they were all stained from the blood. Ah. <sighs> It's not too late. She could still be alive. Why would anyone take her? It doesn't make sense. The man left some blood. Where he fell over. You could follow him. Why don't you do what the boy says? I'm going to go home in case Leandra shows up. This blood is fresh. There are lingering traces of... something. I think this was used for blood magic. If we hurry, there might be a trail we can follow. There's another. More blood. I'm on the right path. Where is he taking her? There. The foundry. They must have gone inside. This place feels strange. Wrong. I wonder if we'll find more than just a sack of bones this time. Mother must be here somewhere. We need to look around. There. More blood. They are here somewhere.
Mother. Alessa. Make his breath. That smell. I know this locket. It belongs to Mother. this oh that's a pretty little shrine the woman in the painting she almost looks like mother a shrine dedicated to a wife a sister i need to find her now I was wondering when you'd show up. Leandra was so sure you'd come for her. Where is she? You will never understand my purpose. Your mother was chosen because she was special. And now, she is part of something... greater. I don't want to hurt anyone. Release my mother, and we'll go. She is here. She is waiting for you. I have done the impossible. I have touched the face of the Maker and lived. Do you know what the strongest force in the universe is? Love. I pieced her together from memory. I found her eyes, her skin, her delicate fingers, and, at last, her face. Oh, this beautiful face. I searched far and wide to find you again, beloved. And no force on this earth will part us.
mother. There's nothing I can do. His magic was keeping her alive. I knew you would come. Don't move, Mother. We'll find a way to... Shh! Don't fret, darling. That man would have kept me trapped in here. Now, I'm free. I get to see Bethany again. And your father. But you'll be here alone. I'll miss you. My little boy has become so strong. I love you. You've always made me so proud. Did you find her? I'm sorry, Uncle. She's gone. You were right about the flowers and everything. I... I can't believe she's gone. I was too late. So you're to blame. If you'd been quicker or stronger, you could have... She could be... <laughs> Why her? Why Leandra? Mother's gone. Will knowing why ease the pain? No, it won't. It will always seem senseless, won't it? Where's the one who did this to her? Did you find the person who killed Leandra? He's dead. It won't bring Leandra back, but I'll take comfort in knowing that. You've had a long day, so I'll go to the gallows to talk to Carver. He'll need to know about this. Take care, my boy. I came as soon as I heard. You know where to find me if you want to talk about it. I understand if you don't. again. How he makes these things, I'll never know. Sandal's quite useful to have around. That he is. Oh, oh Maker knows what'll happen when I'm gone. I'll try not to think about it. I want some pie. Always at your service, Miss Air. Hawk. I don't care what else is going on. We haven't spoken about Leandra. How are you? I have a smile on my face. That should be enough for most people. That doesn't work on me. I knew her too. I want to think my mother was like her. I just have flashes of impossibly long hair. But my father... Would you like to hear one thing? You've never talked about him. My father trained me in all the skills he had been forced to give up. He spent everything to get me into Kaelin's service. 
Do you know what I remember? When he read to me, stupid things, dragons and heroes. He wouldn't turn a page until I reached over and took his hand. That big man made every step of the story my choice. I loved that. He died of the wasting in a Denerim ward. Those last weeks, I read to him. I had to take his hand to turn the pages, and I couldn't tell if he was too weak, or if it was the old game. He smiled at that, at his big girl. I don't know why I'm telling you this. Drink? I don't think so. Good. Feel it. Everything. Wallow in it. And when someone says, move on, you take their hand and say, my choice. That's all I have. I'll miss her too. Nothing going on, Hawk. 